Finally tonight here, you saw so many of the children right here, children at risk of starvation, four countries on the brink of famine. We witnessed the devastation, but also the smiles when that much needed help arrives. Tonight, a joint global response never seen before. We took you along on our journey, that eight hour trek across Somaliland, where doctors and nurses tonight are still in a race against time. At the first hospital, we saw Hamda, nearly two years old, weighing just 11 pounds. The nurse working to save her telling us at the time Hamda was so weak, they feared she would die within minutes after arriving. More than 100 miles away, another hospital in Barao. We won't forget Dr. Yusuf Ali and what he told us. You're on the verge of famine. That's what I believe. That's what I believe. You're seeing it. We're seeing it. It's, it's here. There was little Osman who lost the strength to talk, his tiny hand in mind. Tonight, for the first time ever, eight U.S.-based international relief organizations are now joining forces to get the word out that urgent help is needed in Somalia, South Sudan, Nigeria, and Yemen. More than 20 million facing starvation. Actor George Clooney lending his voice. Americans are the most generous people on the planet. Helping others is ingrained in our spirit. So many of you at home already proving that, giving nearly $2 million in donations after our report. Tonight, those eight organizations now working as one, creating the Hunger Relief Fund, saying $2 can provide water at school for an entire month. $1.30 can buy antibiotics to help a severely malnourished child recover in South Sudan. The head of Save the Children helped spearhead this joint effort. You're standing here now to sound the alarm. We really need people to realize what's going on across these four countries. We actually can make a difference for these kids if we act now. Where are you? Where are you? The children being helped <laughs> by so many of you. We thank you for watching here on a Wednesday night. I'm David Muir. I hope to see you right back here tomorrow. Good night.